Why can't you smile, children? Aren't you happy? We are. All right. Yeah. Just saying, washi. Washi. I think that's all. So. Bro, to say India, Nani, Manu, to say India, to say India, Nesu. To my name.
he, he did when, when he was uh, thinking of what to do to find a solution, <coughs> he bought this piece of land from one of the niece of his wife, and uh, the, the niece was Dorothy. And uh, what happened is that uh, after he just bought a piece of land, um, the niece, because of family disputes, she was killed by the husband. She was murdered. And the end, the, short, the end of the story is this, that Dorothy did not find justice because the husband was in connection, or his family was connected to, <coughs> if I say the name, one of the big politicians in this country. Now he's uh, late with George and Dorothy because uh, when the case was on, he demanded that that guy be released. And so Dorothy never found justice. So the reason we exist is to, to see that uh, the girls whose rights are violated, they get their rights, they know how to fight and to understand, to be aware when their rights are violated. So we are helping them to understand that and empowering them so that they can be better people in the community. Isn't that wonderful? Great. Right. So you're welcome. That is the short story of Dorothy. Why Dorothy? in honor of that lady who lost her life and never found justice. That is why we are called Dorothy. So you're most welcome. Now we got the 12 girls uh, in 2009, but now we are 38 girls. You, as you've heard from the introduction, we have some who are in colleges, some are just finishing. We have some who have done Form 4. We have a group of like four girls who have finished Form 4 and they are doing their computer courses and all that. We have girls in junior high school, we have uh, some girls in primary level. We have these uh, young girls in PT1, PT2, grade 1, and all that. And it will be beautiful. We thank God when we see you people come to partner with us because we believe these are eye calling and they're just answering to that. So when we see you people come, we are so grateful. And we grateful, guys. Yeah. yeah, we are so grateful. So uh, you're most welcome. We will not want to take much of your time because. Uh, we would want to give him all the time to celebrate with us as he's just informed us that he's celebrating his birthday. He will tell us how old he is turning. Uh, maybe we can guess. Our <coughs> someone will try to guess for me. I have a guess right now. I'll say it later. Thank you. Uh, we would not want to take more time uh, because we will speak later after you are done. So can we because want to get to know the team from his side. Who can I give this microphone to? Tala. Tala. So, uh, we are not going to take much of your time because today is celebration. Uh, as I told you, my names are Moses Mwenda, Itile, those are my full names. And uh, I'm so excited to be here with you to celebrate my birthday with these angels yeah. today. I did a birthday party somewhere else for my friends, my other friends. And I thought it is wise for me to come and celebrate with you here. First, I want to tell you that uh, I really understand what it means having no parents. Because I lost my dad and that is the time I felt the pain. So I know. But I want to comfort you today. You you can become what you want to become in life. Nataka ni wambie msome kwa bidi. Walo anataka kubua mandaktari, wakue mandaktari. Pilots, wakue ma pilots. Sibio? Si mnasoma, mkwe shule. Sibio? Mkwe kama mimi. Kwa sawa. Kwa bimi, I lost my land. Mwambie hivyo. Sibio? Na I'm here very strong. So, we have God who is our father. Right? So, guys, I'm very excited to be here to celebrate with you. My birthday was on 4th, April, and uh, we came here to share with you a piece of, a slice of cake, and enjoy, uh, have fun, uh, love, uh, play some game, and have a good day. Are you excited? Yes. Are you excited? Yes. So, uh, I have an empowerment called the uh, Wenda Empowerment Foundation. That's where you see I'm um, accompanied by so many friends. Uh, who decided to come with me to celebrate this day. This is a great day for me and for you. Yeah. And I want to assure you, I'll be coming here each and every time. Welcome. 
uh, are you going to allow me to come here? Yes. Next time? Yes. And come and enjoy and uh, bring more uh, cakes to you? Yes. Good. So, uh, I don't want us to waste time. I came with my family, my two kids here. I would like uh, they come in front and say their names and say something. Linda? Congratulations. Tunawapongeza kwa sababu wameshirikiana na wageni wetu uh, ambao natusaidia vizuri kabisa uh, na ti, pia tunashukuru wizara ya afya ambayo pia ile husika kwa kikisha kwa mba wanakuja na wanapata nafasi ya kutibu uh, watu wetu. Vile mnavyojua rais wa Jamhuri ya Kenya amewekea manani sana mambo ya matibabu. Tunataka kile tunaita universal health care. Iende kwa kila mtu ili mkenya wote yoyote hata asipokuwa na uwezo sana lakini awe na nafasi ya kupata matibabu. Na hiyo ndiyo lengo letu kabisa hata wakati tulipokuwa tukibadilisha sheria ya mambo ya afya ni kuelekeza nguvu zetu ili tuwe na universal health care katika taifa letu. On behalf of the government of Kenya, uh, particularly the Ministry of Health, uh, and also on behalf of the county government of uh, Kiambu and the area MP of this area, we express our appreciation for this partnership that is bringing everybody together so that uh, those in need of treatment can be treated. Uh, have a, the, the doctors here uh, are from all over the world, uh, whether from Canada, the Americas, uh, from New Zealand, from Africa like Botswana, uh, from countries in Europe. They've come from all over the globe, a team of 65 doctors, uh, and they're doing a sterling job. They started in Uganda where they were able to attend to 2,000 people plus they entered into Vihiga County or in Western Kenya they attended to over 500 people now in the two days here they are going to attend to over 2,000 and tomorrow in the wee hours of the morning at about 5 a.m. they'll be leaving towards Arusha to attend to another uh, team of uh, people there as you know East Africa we're all brothers and sisters so they are crisscrossing and going into these countries to help those who need some treatment. So we want to say thank you. We appreciate this strong partnership. We look forward to, to having more of this. And uh, definitely their visit uh, is a, a show of great teamwork and it has had massive impact on our society. But what we are planning is now we want to see how we can collaborate with these county governments and how we are more you and to have a continuous, you know, uh, medical camps, working with closely with the doctors here, and so that at least in certain areas we can help, you know, because our doctors are pretty good. We have seen that there is a lot of dental problems. Uh, many people were been, you know, uh, you know, been uh, root canal problems. A uh, lot of uh, teeth were, you know, replaced. I mean, we were pulled out and you know cleaned up, you know, and then we have a lot of people was having a problem of uh, vision and uh, especially we have need to notice that a lot of children uh, were not able to see the blackboards so we brought and distributed and uh, we had four ophthalmologists with the local ophthalmologist support and also we have seen the people in surgeries uh, you know small lump diseases uh, lumps you know were operated and orthopedic a lot of people have elderly people have orthopedic issues and also some of them are cardio in general, you know, uh, general, you know, I mean, problems. But in general, I think uh, the people 
uh, we have seen it that uh, they are quite uh, healthy, not bad compared to other countries like you know other countries. But I think uh, you know uh, we brought the awareness among the people what they should do, how should they take care and all. And uh, with the medication given for over one month, I think people will be happy and maybe you know things like that. Yes. And these doctors are amazing, you know, spending their own time, spending their own money, and then they are coming and serving people. And we have seen the people are very happy. So we are trying to do our best. And uh, so they're just giving a helping hand to what government of Kenya is doing. We thank government of Kenya, His Excellency, Prime, our uh, President and His Excellency, Prime Cabinet Secretary, and especially the Minister of Health, uh, you know, uh, for supporting us and this project with, along with the county governments of Kiambu and also Vihiga.
kuna kuna representative kwa ofisi yake maybe pe, kama kuna remarks pia atafanya thank you very much our chief guest honorable our prime dr rao na timu yako yote for the wonderful service that you have given to the people of udheru hii kitu imekuja si mnajua tuko na issue na madaktari kidogo na tunaomba Mungu hapo kwa muke ndiyo tuweze kupata matibabu si ndio lakini Mungu anafanyanga kazi na njia mingi na ametuletea hawa watu na wametusaidia si kuna wale wametibiwa na tunashukuru sana kwa sababu hatutibu ile ya juju watu mpaka wanafanywa minor surgery na tunashukuru sana hawa wafadhili wetu and we can only pray that only God pia abariki hawa madaktari